YouTube. We are starting off a little bit of a bang here. Uh, it is day 11 of uh, the long haul, and as you see, there's a zombie at the door. I've just been doing my thing overnight and uh, had a wandering horde to roam through. And let's just uh, take care of the troublemakers out here. Come on. Yeah, I noticed a little bit of wandering horde, so figured you yeah, and it was close to daytime let show you guys still streaming on twitch for uh, live and you know you want to stay at the top of the video if you do uh, want to have interaction live with me on on twitch you know search up milbro 1998 but uh, instead of an e just put in a three in my name and you'll find me i'll have it linked in the in the description down below for you so, yeah, fun little bit of stuff, uh, and so, um, got another bob, you yeah, know, made some mid kits overnight, I realized I had some, uh, I actually brought all my glue with me for some odd reason, because I forgot to empty out my chest at home base, but I realized, I'm like, hey, I can make five first aid kits, so. We have some medical supplies, but um, I also did find a higher level wrench in the Poppin' Pills bathroom, but I wanted to come over and start raiding the the Shotgun Messiah. I probably won't break into the safe for it because it's, uh, that's really hard to break in, so, but we'll at least raid all the gun store boxes. Don't forget to break my, uh, get my helmet light on. I don't know where the the bit of uh, the rest of the water horde is, but eh, they don't bother. They didn't bother me, so I ain't gonna bother them. Aside from the couple that decided to wander over, so Raiden first off with all the paper and everything. Got some beer jars and nothing in that gun store box. Darn. And let's just see here. A bit of plastics from you. Of course, uh, as with uh, every shotgun Messiah, you get a... Um, oh, hey, the Magnum Cylinder. That is the last piece I was looking for for that one. But, uh, as I was saying, you, know, you always find a good little bit of... Uh, um, my apologies. Have a little bit of brain fart here. You always find a working vending machine of those, along with... Uh, Working stuffs, which we will go raid the working stuff that's in this new town. And, but, let's just uh, take a look see here. What barrel is that? That is a pistol barrel. I asked that because it's like the AK 47 barrel shares the same icon. Speaking of the AK 47, we got the receiver, which I don't have the, the schematic to. Um, another rocket launcher receiver and a hunting rifle stock. And we'll check the last box here. Nothing in there. Iron desk, we'll just scrap those down. And started scrapping stuff down for brass when we make a brass pile. Actually, break into the safe, it's like I know people kind of don't like me doing this, but I do this just to... Make it easy on me. And have more paper. It's just, uh, you know, just chop out that wood frame. And if there's a, if it's, like, right in a corner, you just find, um, more. You just chop out the, uh, the block, uh, like, uh, next in the corner, so. Found a leather boot schematic for an airplane and leather working, which is not too bad. Could be better. Uh, let's go and hit up working stuffs. We got the Brother Theater here. Went through that the other day, which is a good little raid. We also got a a Buzz's Bar, but um, we just checking the map here for working stuffs. The I'm having a blast uh, in stream. It's like I don't get many uh, viewers, which is not that big of a deal to me. It's it's like, yo, know, it's like I'm only starting out on Twitch, it's, you know, I'm hoping, you know, to improve things over time, you know, 
Hopefully get a good community built up over on Twitch, yo. But, you know, it's like I enjoy streaming, it gives me something to do. And we're coming up on working stiffs here. There's a prison next door to it. And so, sometimes I question the choices of the POIs that are here, but it's like, uh, other times it's better not to question it. Mikey, come on. You know better, buddy. There you go. I'll just scrap that stuff. I don't keep bullet casings, but I plan on probably after raiding a couple more houses uh, to after working stuff to um you know head back over to hometown. You know, it's a nice little excursion you know, to get out of town, but it's like I don't want to explain expend all the loot in here, so. Just get you harvested up, and then let's just go take out Steve's boy here. There you go. Enjoy. And then we got a boss of Curly. I don't need you swinging at me, buddy. You're already a big boy. Wow. He is hardy, and then again, I'm not going for headshots, but... There you go. Seems to work a little bit better. Canopies, I'll take it. And we'll just take that glass of water. Thank you for your contribution, Curly. I'm just gonna <laughs> we'll flex our way through here and doot, doot. And one more hit. What do you got for me, working stiffs? I would like some nail gun parts. Iron boots, I'll take that though. And we'll just first work its a box. And wood frames. I'll just grab them for wood at the moment. Okay. Please, a couple nail gun parts. That would be greatly appreciated. Or an iron shovel and some wood frames. Hello. Would you like my last shot of blunderbuss? Ow. Ow. There you go. Enjoy. I'll just use a med kit to heal up. I gotta kinda reduce them down to a little one stack. Like, I wanna try to take as much possible home with me, so. Next uh, box, nail gun parts. I already have the receiver, so that's excellent. Um, we'll keep the headlight for now. Okay. Start. Scrapping stuff, and... Okay, so... Where are we gonna... Sounds like we got company. Got Charlie, who wanted to say hello to me. There you go. Take your head, take your head. Did invest a little bit more into Pummel Pete. Marlo. Hello. Okay. There we go. Looking pretty good. So, back into working stuffs. Oh, wait. Someone else is in here. Annie, did you come in looking for me? I'm sorry. Didn't mean to treat you like that. Come here. There you go. Okay, make sure I don't miss anything in the bathroom. And nothing in that sink. Until I get seal smithing, all extra wrenches are always welcome. So we'll just take that and actually eat the blood bag. Seems a little weird, but inventory management, I tell you. And there we go. Not nothing really in the bathroom, but there are a bit of some vitamins. Not in the sink. Let's go check the back room. We'll just break through the door here. Give me a second. Oh, I know my iron tools are breaking a little bit, but... Come here. We're almost through. Voila. Please give me some of the good working steps. Um, rebar frames. I would take them... I wouldn't scrap them usually, but... 
I really want to make sure I just uh, kind of condense things down. We'll just take take the wood frames and make them into wood. And we'll just come on. And nothing that one. Nails and a car battery. That's not too bad. And let's just check to see the last couple. Auger blade, that's pretty good. Can make an auger now. <laughs> it's like I can already make a, you can already make auger blades in workbenches. It's just the uh, you need to grab. Um, how do you say it's? It's just that uh, the hardest part to find for an auger for an auger is uh, is the actual like gears parts of it. It's like, uh, you can make handlebars, and it's like you can find engines easily in the, in the game. It's like, you know, out of cars, or maybe even working stuff's boxes. It's like, uh, it's really not that hard. It's just that, like, uh, you kind of have to either get, get the chainsaw parts from a trader, or the auger parts, uh, depending on which ones you're looking for, and, or, uh, find, find in a car. They're kind of a rare drop. Uh, shotgun long barrel. We'll just scrap you down. That's looking pretty good for loot, though. Did I check the size of the store, though? More paper, and check the drink coolers always. Beer and all that. More brass. Uh, what's clogging up my inventory? Ah, uh, car batteries. Is, it's about to be scrapped down. We'll just check out the, um, check out the good old, uh, rooftop here. Usually has some good loot. Okay. Charlie, where are you, buddy? Okay, not, eh, lead and all that. We'll just take, throw that moldy bread out. Just kind of, you know, work on all this, and... For the sake of it, we'll just throw in hunting rifle stock and all that. And I already checked you. Last but not least, the weathered sports bag. Wooden club, iron reinforced clubs. We'll just scrap those down for iron. Actually, scrap my old one down. And <laughs> make a new one, so. Well, as I've had a workbench, uh. Like, you know, found one at a gas station, I would actually, uh, you know, loot it and everything like that. Oh, hey, this house actually has a, has a, um, what do you call it? Pool in it. For water. Not too bad. I've, I'd say hit, I've hit up most of the, uh, main POIs in this town, which, uh, which I'm happy to do, uh, but... We'll save the rest of this town for for some other time once uh hopefully have like you know maybe a mini bike but or we just feel a little bored. Anyways, uh let me just get I'm actually going to get my loot together and everything like that, and I will meet you guys at the airdrop from yesterday. Alrighty, and we are coming up on the airdrop now. Let's just see what's in the in here. SMG barrel and a SMG barrel, iron glove schematic, AK-47 schematic, another rocket launcher receiver. Um, we'll actually just drop this headlight. I don't really need it. It's I can find more later. And then, let's just see here, I'm trying to see potentially I could, I don't really find too much rocket launcher stuff, but it'd be nice. So we'll just drop the feathers. Oh, Bob, hello. Yeah, it was tough, uh, there were some tough decisions made, but, while, uh, leaving the town, but, it was, uh, it was all for a decent cause, so. I wish Bob would get his head out of the ground. Come here. 
There you go. Come on. There you go, Bob. You have anything on you? No, thankfully. Okay. So on the way back, I'm actually gonna make a stop at Trey Erecti and see if I can see if I can make a couple dukes. And I think, if I remember correctly, I don't remember if he's um, he's restocked or not. Or I think that might have been yesterday. If I remember, I think Traders restock on on a the same days as airdrops do, like if you have them set to every three days, so let me just head over to Trader Erect and I'll meet you there. Alrighty, and we made it over to Trader Erect. Wonder wonderful stuff here. Let's see if we could sell anything else to him. He probably won't be too happy to have more puffer coats, but hey, I'm trying to give him stock. Hi Trader Erect. You buy. Uh huh. Yeah, sure. Okay. There you go. Take some. Eh, if he, I don't know if he'll take it, but black leather duster and regular leather duster. Actually, to give you, I'll give you like half my stack of of leather. So. Looking good there. He restocks on day 13, but take a look through his uh, wares, see what he's got at least. What you got? Um, got the rifle barrel, don't really care for it. 44 magnum parts I can't afford. Otherwise, I'd probably take it. And. Not too much in there. Let's. What do you got in the secret stash? Some nice stuff that I can't afford, unfortunately. Oh well. Cha-ching! Thanks, buddy. I was wanting to check though, like just to be absolutely sure. No, he didn't have anything Son like uh bitch. He didn't have anything like like um Watch yourself, stranger. I nail gun stuff. That is like the big quest to me now. I want to have a nail gun at least. Yeah, you know, very quick upgrades, but um, I was told Twitch chat that I realized uh, over by the town I had a trader over there. I was like, I forgot. To, I did not realize to check the map. How oh, I wish somebody would have told me, but eh. We can go see him next time we go up to, the, to that town. I'm thinking probably next time I go to that town will be after after night fourteen, well day fourteen's horde. So I'm just gonna run over to town here and I'm gonna put some stuff away, and I'll let you know once that's done. Alrighty, YouTube, I have done. Some assembly, did shotgun assembly. We have a level 175 shotgun. Almost have a full hunting rifle. Done most of the merging stuff. We got the Magnum now at level 142, which is excellent. Only one AK piece and rocket launcher piece, but not too bad. So we're looking better on that. Even only got a quality level out of the SMG barrel, but is better than nothing. And we are two pieces out of four needed for the nail gun. Yeah, looking pretty nice here. Okay, grab those out again because I don't want to clog that up. So, um, well, I need to remember to get myself some... I need to remember to get myself some, uh, gunpowder and everything like that. And I need some stone to make a make a make some blunderbuss ammunition so it's one of those uh i figured let's uh let's start let's start again on making um, you know making some more what am i trying to say here you know, let's start making concrete so take care of psycho steve over here since i saw him I don't want to feel like he's being ignored. 
There you go. There you go. Have your fun. Thank you for the duct tape. I appreciate it, Sex Steve. But anyways, uh, let me get some... I'm gonna go get some resources, and I will let you know once uh, it's getting close to nighttime. Well, um, I just wanted to take a quick little break over here, you know, like, I was collecting resources, and I realized, uh, my town is actually on the outer edge of the world, which is, you can see that it's right over, like, we're right about 4,000 west, so, you know, it's, uh, I was looking at this island, I'm like, it would be really cool to have for a base, you know, kind of like, well, for a fun build and everything, but I'm like, oh, it's wasteland. Well, radioactive wasteland, so unfortunately can't use it. But thought I'd provide you, you two peeps, uh, a little update on that, so. Anyways, back to my resource collecting. Alrighty, YouTube, I'm just digging up some gravel on the side of the road here, since this is a road, yo. Know, basically go into the wasteland, uh, I figured, yo. Know, won't hurt to just start digging all this out, but I'd say had a pretty good episode, uh, you know, found some good stuff over in the newer town, so, but I'm gonna uh, leave it here. Uh, if you uh, want to watch this stream, uh, watch this uh, with me live on Twitch, check out Middleborough 1998, you know, I'll have it linked down in the, in the description of the video for you. Have a great day and take care.